I'm grateful that my mom has somebody um, in her life that, that, that puts her before anything else, just as much as she puts everybody else before her. Um, it's, it's admirable to see, and uh, I'm just grateful for, for beyond what, what you do for, for my wife and I, um, but what you do for my mom and, and how you look at her, and I know that she's being loved the way that she deserves to be loved. Just to sum it up, I think everyone right now knows how Nikki makes you feel in life. Like she always puts everyone else before her. Her nature is so amazing. And I think most people that know what she offers is so simple and so amazing and so beautiful. There's something about you. Something about you. Oh, there's something. the covenant that you're about to make with each other is meant to be a beautiful and sacred expression of your love for each other. As you pledge your vows to each other, as you commit to a life to, together, I charge you to do so in all seriousness, yet with a deep sense of joy, a deep sense of conviction that you're committing yourselves to a dynamic, growing relationship built on trust and caring love. together for as long as we both show them. Nick, I'm so thankful for you. Your heart is like the strongest piece of gold, and I couldn't have been blessed with a better best friend. This year and soon to be too has been fun to watch you grow more in love with your old high school mate and navigate this crazy thing we call life together. Timmy, I love that you are in it to win it. I know you will do your best to take care of our best friend today and always. I wish you both nothing but, the, but a blessed future. It won't be perfect or always how you pictured it. But God has gone before us and knows it all. It's been perfectly written for two imperfect people. By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. Tim, you may kiss your bride. I'd like to introduce to you for the first time, Mr. and Mrs. Haney.